Live sentence. Kendall Harrison is convicted in the shooting death of a man who was trying to stop a carjacking two years ago. The shooting happened January 25th of 2012 on Vallette Street in Algiers Point. Mike Ainsworth was killed in front of his children. I went back to the scene of the crime today, talked to people who were there the day the Good Samaritan was murdered. And oh, he was wonderful. And his two kids, he raised them real nice. How you doing, Mr. Melvin? He was bringing them to school. That's what he was doing. Many neighbors, like Melvin Odenwald, remember it like it was yesterday. Maybe his family will be able to uh, get a little peace of mind now because he was a great guy. He really, really was. He meant good for the whole neighborhood. A jury of six men and six women deliberated for more than six hours. They found 20 year old Kendall Harrison of Harvey guilty of second degree murder and armed robbery. The verdict came down at 3 10 a.m. Tuesday. We're glad that they got the one that did it, you know. It took them a little while. This is the scene today, two years after the shooting. Mike Ainsworth was murdered here as he tried to stop a carjacking. Police say Ainsworth had just dropped off his sons at the bus stop when he heard screaming and saw then 17 year old Kendall Harrison trying to carjack his neighbor. Ainsworth jumped on the hood of the van to stop the crime. That's when he was shot through the windshield, all in front of his children and many neighbors. It was a very sad day. People who live here say the Algiers Point neighborhood hasn't been the same since. And the lady moved after that. The lady that happened, she was living off that thing. She moved, and the, and the guy that they killed, his wife moved. Ainsworth was known as the neighborhood do gooder, a volunteer and aspiring police officer. While neighbors are finding comfort in Harrison's conviction, it's a day they say they won't soon forget. And if he just can shoot somebody, that's trying to save a lady from getting her car jacked and, and get by with it. Well, this would be a sad world to live in. I'm glad that justice was served. And so, again, Harrison could face life in prison.